All right, hello, this is Claire Fair, Sarah 333, and I'm here to do your video, and I ain't got no cards. <laughs> hey, y'all. <clears throat> I'm going to use these because I've been using them all day in my own tarot card readings or well, personal readings and if you pay me money pay screenshot and call back <laughs> i mean just in case you didn't leave your number and um anyway let's read first card for the collective holy spirit it said hold on to your money right now save some money because you might need it and i feel like it's time somebody holding on to you but you probably was going to get ready to let this person go I feel like it's uh, somebody coming in and you. They want to be with you and everything. You like this person too. You love this person even. I feel like you're looking at this person right here. And I feel like this person very tempting and delicious. Um, seven of Pentacles here. I feel like you know that someone is worrying about money. And I feel like you had an argument with this person too. I feel like at this time here, if for some reason, this person right here, they moved too damn fast and all that. Five of Pentacles. And was left out in the cold. Or they left you out in the cold either or man or woman. So, with seven of pentacles here, for some reason, this person is worrying. I heard they're worrying themselves to death, okay? With a five of, okay, conflict. For, probably because y'all was arguing or something like that or something, you know, some kind of mis, well, I ain't going to say it's a misunderstanding. Somebody wants you to think that something was a misunderstanding, but I don't think so. I heard they're going to play that. <laughs> I mean, that ain't funny because somebody come in here real quick that ain't let you go. They rushing in right now to talk to you, but money could be an issue with this person. There was some conflict with this person too, but you love this person. That's what I'm seeing. You love the devil. That's what I'm seeing. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, or Aries, Libra, or Taurus. Okay, well, you got somebody here looking at money. And a Leo, I feel like at this time here that <laughs> it don't have to be. But I feel like it is or Aries. I feel like it was a time moment here at this time too. With this person here. They went through some shit and stuff like that. Some kind of confusion they went through here. And it was very petty. And um they are needing you for something. But you're doing good. You're gonna be fine. You start in the beginning. I feel like you were dealing with somebody who dressed nice and everything like that. I feel like at this time with the Emperor card that you you're dealing with somebody who is a boss. They haven't no, you're dealing with somebody who who going through no, they're going through bad luck, for real. They're having bad luck here. Um, they couldn't wait on something either. They they're having bad luck though. Let me look. Cause this person coming in and offer you love. How you offer love to the tower? Cause there was a breakup here and there was a fight and there was an argument. Yeah, cause there was an ending too. The truth was spilled. The beans was too. And somebody didn't want to listen to you. Y'all weren't seeing eye to eye. Y'all was very different. But you were dealing with somebody that was codependent or sneaky. Nah, now they want to take something back. Now you want to take something back? No. But they can't. Mm -mm. I feel like there was a conflict in the ending. I feel like all things that went wrong with this person... I feel like somebody spying on you, watching you and everything like that. Somebody watching you tell the truth on them, too. They ain't saying nothing or nothing like that. I see you holding money in your hand, too. I feel like at this time, somebody was gossiping about you, talking about you and everything like that. But I feel like this person right here, you was ignoring them. And then I feel like at this time, you know you got haters and stuff like that. We already know that. And so I feel like you had cut a lot of people off. You blocked them and all that. I feel like these people are guilty. They said they feel betrayed here, but they betrayed you here too. So you have felt some type of way about this person here. So you probably still feel this some type of way about a situation here. So let's look at this Queen of Swords because you said I'm not having it here at this time. And you know other people was in this situation. I see drama. Uh, yeah, drama, five of ones. Drama, five of ones, and secret. So. I feel like at this time somebody had did something behind your back, but you already knew it or something like that. Anyway, so you asking this person a question here, the tower. I feel like at this time here, uh-uh, they begging. 
I feel like you come, if, uh-uh, you finna get a new love offer. And, um, I feel like at this time here, one of them you ain't gonna take. Here. Here. Move on, move on. Wow, somebody ain't got nothing. Oh, that, I don't know. It look like. <sighs> Everybody turned on them. Oh, yeah, you was betrayed. Let's look at that. Ten of swords in the house. Well, you was betrayed by somebody you love that was fake. You tried to love them, but there was two love offers here. It was, but but I feel like somebody had cut you off, or you cut them off because of the truth here, too. Gossiping and talking and lying. This person got legal issues here. They were listening to somebody else here. That's what I keep seeing. They're going through karma here. Justice will serve. How? They got to move. They got to pack their beds and move. Oh, my God. They ain't got nowhere to go with either conflict. Yeah. This person getting locked up or something, okay? Somebody going to jail. You got a victory. You doing you and everything like that. You got a new beginning in love to the player rushing in with the lovers. Wow. They having a hard time with you. Oh, my God. I feel like whoever they chose or whatever, now, nah, um, you can feel their energy and everything like that. I ain't lying. I feel like this person right here, you looking at them. Let me see. Could be dealing with Virgo, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, of a Gemini, or Leo, or Scorpio. And then trap. What you, what you catch? This person coming off a real sweet begging and all that. So secrets, you know, got revealed about the situation. Somebody need to change their car or, or their tires here. Somebody walking behind you like they need you. They done got on your nerves. They betrayed you a whole a dozen times. That's what I heard. A victory. So somebody watching you get a victory and all that, but you ended somebody or ended it with something, a situation, work, love, a life, so you can sleep, get some rest, something was draining your energy. I feel like at this time you had went through a whole bunch at this time too. So you're thinking about your stability. Justice will serve, you know, I feel like justice gets served fast when people mess with you. Anyway, so you're thinking about your money and all that. You got somebody coming off all sweet, all loving. You finna get some messages and everything like that. Like a whole bunch of text messages going back and forth here between you and someone else. So I feel like you was dealing or you are dealing with a player. Now nah, you are dealing with a player. I feel like at this time you already know that this person got like a new beginning of love here. There was some kind of temptation here. And um, I feel like at this time you was good to them here. They want to come back to you. But I feel like they took your kindness for weakness and you tried to be kind to them more than one time here too. This person had you all in your feelings. You could be feeling their emotions and all that. But there was a confusion and you said you wouldn't no option. So we already know that. So I feel like you had told this person facts about themselves and everything. They hate you for that. Right here. And it, it's something that you said struck a match. It did. Look. At the top, Martin Luther King striking a match. Something that you said, because you said it right there. Got somebody spying on you, ain't saying nothing, calling you to. Um, something that you said pissed this person off. And now they feel messed up. And you may have told, or you're going to tell this person to leave you alone. You're strong. This person know you're strong and everything like that. Let's look at what you said. Because you said some stuff to this person. You told them they changed to, you told them they ain't getting nothing from you. <laughs> um, so I see a new beginning, new home, new house, new job, new business, new money. You told them that they was um doing stuff behind your bed, okay? I ain't gonna lie, somebody said some stuff like, you told them that they like um the same sex. <laughs> um, This person got voodoo on them. You told them, I mean, I ain't gonna say you told them that you're gonna go shopping. Oh, you told them that you know, somebody else was in this situation. Matter of fact, oh my God. <sighs> you told them everything that they were doing and everything like that. And money, oh my God. You told them they was going to get used by other people. It's almost like you said, yeah, you can play me if you want to. All they're going to do is use you and everything. Everything you said came true. Show did how priestess came out. Um, ooh, I feel like it is time here for some reason you all in your head here. But only because you can feel their emotions. So you need to pray that away. Psalms 91. So look at this person begging like crazy. This person come out sweet here. And you tell them to get away from you here too. And because they bring you drama and stuff like that. 
feel like they're looking at the phone. Matter of fact, you're going to get a phone call because I saw a whole bunch of messages here. So secrets was ex exposed out of this tower about this person here. Thinking that they can go back and forth with you with another person. But you said no. Here, you had your guard up with this person anyway. And um, I feel like at this time you're dealing with somebody with some addictions or something like that. But I'm going to look at this Queen of Swords. Somebody dealing with a bad mother or, or something like that who talked shit to a kid or whatever too. They real fake. Wow, somebody dealing with somebody real fake here. And somebody don't like your daughter. Okay, so, oh well. Somebody dealing with somebody crazy. Somebody don't like their daughter or their daughter-in-law. And you told this person that this mother figure was crazy. And you told them that you don't want shit to do with them either. Because this person right here was like trying to destroy you and somebody who loved you. Because you was in love. Yeah, that's a family member. Five of Ones is family drama at work. Because somebody could have somebody trying to get them fired at work, too. You finna go in the office, for real. Um, but I feel like you're going to come out on top here. I heard I'm free. Block. Truth came out of the tower. About somebody who's trying to play you. They walking behind you with all their secrets and shit. Aquarius and a, um, Pisces here. Or Libra, Geron, Aquarius, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So it counts to, but anyway, Virgo, but I feel like at this time here, it's a lot of stuff you was doing. You just had, you were just busy. Someone here worrying about money and talking to you here. Yeah, I feel like, yeah, they are. And I don't feel like you studying them a little bit. You know your worth because someone was trying to bring you some drama and you knew it. So you was done all the way, the two of cups, but you was their true love and everything like that. I feel like someone could be all in their feelings and crying here, but this person was very immature here. They're going to get some not so good news here too, because somebody rejected or treated the person that was like the boss wrong, the emperor, the empress. And I feel like one person was thinking about money. The other person was, you know, thinking about love, but there was some kind of picture here. What kind of picture? Whoa. Somebody said they ain't giving up fucking with you. At all. Not at all. They mad as fuck. You being stalked like crazy. Let me look. Somebody want to get close to you for real. I feel that way. This person right here, you know, I ain't going to lie. Woo. The lovers coming back to you. Okay, no, no. I keep seeing somebody want to come back to you and you saying no. But <sighs> probably because you're doing good right now. And um, this person full of shit and drama and stuff like that. They tried to disrespect you. Oh, no, they didn't try. They did. Somebody's disrespecting you right here. No communication, no talking. But somebody taking up for you too with someone else. Now, I feel like the other person who they were dealing with that was putting stuff in their head, they hate them now. They giving them hell. And that person want them to get the fuck on, move out, get the fuck on, move out here. Because this other person is talking shit to this other person. And the other person said, you know what? I already know everything about you. I was in denial about you before, but I know who I love because they love you. But this person was weak and, you know, wasn't really thinking or nothing like that. Did something stupid, real stupid, because I keep seeing them holding their head down, crying, and all that. Now they having some kind of drama, conflict with this other person, for real. It's almost like they got set up for the okie doke here. And the snake was revealed, trap. And I feel like this person probably gonna get in some kind of trouble, too, because the other person that was involved that they was given to, they they treating them like shit now because somebody treating somebody like shit, either them or someone else. They see you getting a victory. They chasing you and everything. I feel like it is time. Yeah, they're coming to apologize to you, but I feel like they felt like you was good to them because without you, you know, 
nobody ain't treat them like you did. They're going to be left fighting the cold. But you see this person in a different light as a player. And you don't really want nothing to do with them or nothing like that. That's what I'm seeing. Let's see. Next card for the collective. Give me something. Yeah, Death to the Seven of Swords. They said, I ain't going to lie no more. I ain't going to be sneaky no more. Or nothing like that. Let me cover up my tracks and everything like that. Because I know I lied to your face and all that. Too, you could be dealing with a Scorpio. This person reaching up to you and everything like that. They said that I don't need nobody else. <laughs> they coming in to apologize to you. But that was an ending and everything because somebody was being sneaky and thought they were doing something behind your back and were trying to cover their tracks, but they couldn't. This person really love you. That's what I see. But they was a liar all the time. Yeah, they love you to death. They love you for real. They, they don't know what to do without you or nothing like that. They're jealous of you a little bit, though. They're jealous of the work you do. Friends around the money issues. They're jealous of your money here. They're jealous that people like you here. They're coming in to apologize, apologize, but they did this more than one time. They think they can go back and forth with you then. They think they're a player. They can't even lie, but they think they're a player. Oh, wow. They is in love with you, but I feel like they found love somewhere else and thought they could replace you. It was two love offers. Love offers. This person had secrets. They were lying. So you ended it with this person. Y'all were like best friends, too. Wow, money, money. What does money got to do with you? Oh, wait a minute. So, wait a minute. Why are you coming back to apologize? Angels and spirits, tell us why are you coming back to apologize? They gave me the seven of swords. They said they need something. What else? Why are you coming back to apologize? Remember, they left you out in the cold, but there was some fear surrounding money issues. And there was an ending, too. Right here. You could be dealing with Taurus or Pisces with these cards. I heard of a Libra. I, I see, you know, green, real. Green, 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 green. Here. Then they gave me the Seven of Swords. So, why you come back to apologize? But they don't know if they should or not. They come back to apologize because they try to play you. What else? What's the motive? Karma. They're going through some shit. Judgment card is karma. <coughs> Hold on. And then there was some kind of confusion, too. You and this person, they come in to apologize because they feel like they make a good couple with you. Let's see. Five of Cups on the bottom of the deck saying that they have regrets. And they're crying over spilled milk. They possibly even crying. There was an ending. The player. With the player. Shit, I heard something crazy. But sh this, you shouldn't be studying this person because I heard disease. Yup. The player in the death card again. The re yeah, they're coming to apologize. Justice. They said because what you said was true because you know the high priestess know everything. You knew that this person loved you. You loved him. Here, you knew this person was going to look back towards you right here. You knew this person had other options or something like that. You knew this person's motive was money and they were jealous of you. Or they were trying to give you competition and they had secrets and stuff like that. I feel like you knew this person was a lady man, ladies man or... A woman's man, you know, like a woman that, you know, like the sh you know, there she go. They're coming back to apologize for cheating on you with a council or a Scorpio or a Pisces. That's what they're doing. Or they coming to apologize because they broke. They ain't got nothing. There was an ending. And there was a breakup real quick, too. They want to have sex with you to try to fix it. But I wouldn't. Because this person had secrets. And there was a lot of people on this card here with a judgment card that they're going through with karma. And they left you confused while they were talking to this person right here. A Libra, a Cancer, a Scorpio, or a Pisces. So now they're crying. They're going to be crying. If they ain't, they're going to be crying here. Because they were thinking about themselves. They didn't care. Seven of Swords, they think they could just lie to people and stuff like that. And manipulate and play mind games. With a magician. Could be dealing with a Gemini. They thought that they could show you unrequited love here. I feel like they tried to make people think that you were jealous of them. But I feel like they were jealous of you. And everything like that. They tried to give you competition. Okay. See, I'm telling you. The Six of Cups said they're coming back right here too. And then the Page of Cups said that they're trying to offer you some kind of 
love offer right here. So show me these people. The devil. Um, oh, <laughs> that's what they were dealing with then. They throwing a tip potential. Oh my God, this person is crying. But you got somebody got more than one person upset. I feel like you ain't studying them. You're going to stand your ground with them, too, because you're looking at them like they're a snake here. Damn. And you're doing your own thing, and you're going to be blessed big time while somebody's going to be sitting back there watching you say it. Here, trying to show you unrequited love when you were good to them and everything like that. So that was an ending because somebody thought they was a snake here, but they ain't do it right. <laughs> and... They try to play you and everything. They show sure did. Girl, honey, let me tell you. The seven of swords with the player card. They thought they were doing something, huh? You went having it. And then now they look like this right here. Scared. Scared and they crying and all that. Let me look. They feel trapped and everything like that because they know you know the truth. Probably because they watching you here. <laughs> I mean, they, they know you know the truth. Oh, you said something? Yeah, because somebody said something that they wasn't supposed to say. Or, they, you know, yeah. So I'm giving back and forth. What's this about this information? Damn, they're coming. I'm for real. And the police, too. The police coming, too. You might need a restraining order because this person is mad, angry. Ooh, 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 ooh. I feel like they pissed about the truth. They thought they could control the Queen of Swords. <laughs> How you gonna control the Queen of Swords is mean as shit and cold here too. This person act like they don't care. They're gonna act like they don't care. Uh uh. They said they got unfinished business with you. And they ain't even getting along with nobody. You told them this. You said everybody gonna shut doing your damn face. Ain't nobody gonna wanna deal with your ass. Don't tell me that you changed because you freaking shady and non committal and everything like that. You might got unfinished business with me, but I'm done with your ass. You done pissed me off and all that. I see somebody screaming and yelling and shit. Cutting up. Somebody need to make sure they stay away from this person. You got to defend yourself. This person do not want to tell the truth about shit. Some, this person want to take over. They want to take over. They throwing a temper tantrum and they got childhood issues for real. They so tricky. They such a freaking liar. You told them that you was going to end it with them. And they're like, I ain't going nowhere. I ain't going nowhere. I ain't going nowhere. I want to show you some more unrequited love. They scared. But I feel like at this time, you were tired of their damn drama. That's what you were tired of. The player scared right here. Because you know secrets about them with the secret card Pisces too. Sexual secrets here with the rabbit. You told them you thought they was doing something behind your bed. But they wouldn't. I feel like it was going back and forth with you and somebody else. So you up there in the corner right here, teaching them a lesson right here. Because they thought there was a snake. Look at that lion looking at Mackie there right here. Somebody got some confusion at work, some drama at work, and somebody trying to get somebody in trouble at work too, okay? Stalkers and all that bullshit, okay? I feel like these are people who you done with and all that. But see, it's not. they don't even know you. Because I feel like you'll figure shit out and everything like that. You be looking for stuff. You're looking for answer. Damn. No. I feel like somebody's going to tell this other person, I don't know. Because I feel like it is time. Ooh, I sure don't know. Because this person is so damn sneaky. They disturb. I feel like it is time they're going to tell you that somebody was sick in the hospital and they had to go visit somebody that they knew. They lying. They lying. I feel like you got a positive change coming for you. You're going to be a star and everything like that. I feel like the only person heart was broken was they heart here. I feel like they're going to be chasing you and everything like that here. You could be dealing with Gemini, Leo, Aries. That's an Aries, the fool, and a Pisces, and a Libra. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, too. So the snake ain't got no damn money. The snake is a thief. The snake coming to apologize to you here. It said avoid the damn snake here because I feel like you stay to yourself. You could be dealing with a Virgo or a, Virgo or a Cancer. I feel like it, oh, hell no, nah. avoid the snake because they ain't changed or nothing like that. They be lying all the damn time, and they show ain't changed here. And somebody want to talk to you, and they know somebody want to talk to you and tell you the truth about this whole person because this whole person got problems. And they talk too much, so now somebody want to tell you something because somebody only want to tell you something because they want you to. 
They want your attention or they just want you. But I feel like it's somebody that they know. And I feel like this person want to expose them. And I feel like this person that got jealous and everything like that because they didn't get what they wanted. I've been picking, it, picking up that energy for a minute. So, yeah. And I feel like at this time, this person going to feel stuck or trapped or caught or something. Or they're going to be caught in their lives or something. Yeah, they is. The Seven of Swords came out right there. Here. And I feel like you're going to be going back and forth with this person begging. They begging, but somebody going to push somebody away. Here, it, it's time to. You're going to be thinking about yourself, too. You keeping things to yourself here. You said, I'm all right, buddy. Here, because you're unhappy. Ooh, and this person going to be all in their damn head. I see happiness coming to you and everything like that. But I know a phone call coming to us, you too. Because somebody was trying to be sneaky here. And this person just, uh, you know, they motives just, ooh, ooh. But they, they ain't going to leave you alone, though. Not at all. Not at all. Hell no, they ain't. Uh-uh. All right. All right. Hold on. Let's see. I think I'm going to drink some water and go to bed. <laughs> All right. Good night, y'all.